Hi there, welcome back. This is Shuvo from Team MyAlice and today I'll show you what values you get from MyAlice dashboard once you connect your WooCommerce store with our WordPress plugin. So once the connection is done, you get a few values. First of all, you can understand more data about the customer, like all their shopping behavior, the funnel they are going through, the products they have seen or put into their car. Secondly, you can take a lot of actions, like you can create order, update order, cancel, refund order, everything from the MyAlice dashboard while just talking to the customer. And finally, all these uh, tasks impact in your reporting as well. So I'll show you quickly how those things work. So consider this is your store and you are just viewing a few products. So let me just quickly select this one. And once you do that, and you want to talk to the customer support let's say just something random you'll see the conversation is coming up here and if you see the product interactions of that customer you can see all the product he has viewed previously so this is the latest one that i have seen but you can see all the other products as well you can see if there is any product in my cart as well if i have put into it or if any products i have bought previously so all this data will help you to either do better product recommendation or upsell or cross sell product as well. And if you click on the customer summary, you can know more about your customer, like their lifetime value, total orders, average order value, order frequencies, which are very important if you want to do more sales. If you click on the order history, you'll see all the orders of that customers popping up. So for example, this is one order. If you click on the summary, you can see the billing address, shipping address, shipping methods, everything. You can see the products that was ordered in this term. And if you want, you can do an update, like changing the email or maybe changing the phone number or address. You can cancel the order if the customer wants to or issue and refund directly from my Alice dashboard with just a few click. Like let's say you just click here and issue and refund, that's it. Even, let's say if the customer is coming from a channel and if the customer wants help to place the order, you can You'll see these products coming up. You can select the product. Then if you want, you can select the variant and going ahead, just fill up the data. If it's already filled previously, it will be popping up here. You can select the payment method and the shipping method and click on the next. It will show you all the data for your confirmation. And within a click, your agent can place the order on behalf of your customers. So if you want to send the order link to the customer, this is basically the order link. So you can just copy it and send it to the customer if you want. And the customer can do the payment if there is any payment required for this order as well. And when you are doing all these processes, you can also search for orders with order ID. So for example, let's say I'm searching for order 585. If there is any order, it will come up here. Or you can search order with customer name or email as well. So see, all the orders for Shuvo is coming down here. So your agent have all this flexibility and superpower in themselves that can, they can use other than all the common features that the inbox offers. And now if you go back to the reports and go to the agent metrics, you can also see what are the sales conversion rate of your agents. Like in this demo, we have a 100% sales conversion rate and the agent has placed a total of three orders and a total of $44 order values. So fundamentally, you are seeing more data that can help you sell more. You are taking a lot of actions most easily just from talking to the customers within a few clicks. And you can see your agent conversion rate, their total sales, everything that helps you to take a better decisions about your sales process. So that's all from my side today.